Hi. On our mission to make Wellington old man's beard free, we are using a map to manage and track our efforts in controlling the weed. This map is color coded to show which patches need control, which patches have been controlled, and which patches need checking. The map was developed by Econet as part of its award-winning CAMS Conservation Activity Management System suite. With over 3,000 reported old man's beard patches, we can't check them all. We'd love your help to check and update them. This video shows you how to find them and update their status on this map. The public CAMS map shows the weed patches entered using iNaturalist. It can be installed on your mobile device or opened using your browser. It is useful to install it on your mobile device for use in the field. COMBfree.nz forward slash mapping for instructions on how to install or open it. On opening the map, you'll notice a lot of different colored markers. Each marker represents a weed patch and is colored to show the current known status of the patch. The common colors are Red, growth is occurring which needs controlling. Purple, the patch needs checking. Yellow, the patch has been controlled this year. And green, there is no regrowth this year. The shape of the marker also indicates whether control work is needed or not. Diamond-shaped markers indicate that no weed control is currently needed. Old man's beard seeds remain viable for about 10 years and the patches need rechecking regularly for new seedlings. To facilitate this, the weed status is reset to purple please check each spring, so that the weed patches are checked for regrowth or seedlings. To see the legend, click on the vertical ellipses in the top right, then select legend. This shows the legend at the bottom of the page. Scroll down to see a description of all the colors. Click X to close the legend. To zoom into your location, click on the circular My Location icon. You may need to zoom in further to get a clearer view. Click on the relevant weed marker on the map to select it. Once the weed marker is selected, some basic information about the weed patch will be displayed. The GPS position isn't always right, so you may need to hunt around to find the weed. If you need more info to help find it, click on the link under iNaturalist URL. This will open the iNaturalist page, which shows more details, including photos, to help you find it. Going back to the CAMS app, under the Weed information you'll see the Update Weed Status button. Click on this to update the status. This will prompt you to log on to iNaturalist if you're not logged in already. If you have controlled the weed patch, click Controlled. Otherwise click Alive or Dead as appropriate. After filling in relevant details, click the Update Observation button. This will update the iNaturalist observation. The weed status on the CAMS map will be updated within the hour. Let's try finding a known old man's beard patch. Opening ArcGIS field maps, it shows the CAMS map. After zooming into my current location, I see I need to walk down the road to get to the old man's beard patch. I'm getting close so I'll click on the icon to find out more details. There's no location description, so I'll click on the iNaturalist URL to see a photo of it. That looks like the bank across the road from me. Let's click on the photo, so I can zoom in and see where the old man's beard is. There it is on the top right of the bank. Looking around the bank now, the old man's beard vines seem to have been mostly controlled. But I can see some regrowth at the top of the bank. I'll update the weed status to say it's alive and fill in some details. We hope this video has been useful.
please email us questions or feedback at kiora at ombfree.nz. Thanks for watching.